Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to another five weekly favorites. We're so happy it's Friday. We hope you guys had a great week. Yes. And you'll have a great weekend. Um, okay, so first up is this. I got this in the little like Olaplex holiday kit um, that I ordered during the Sephora sale. And it's the Olaplex number six bond smoother. And I didn't buy this for a long time because I feel like at first I had mixed reviews and then I just wasn't sure if I needed it. But I actually really love this. I mean, I guess no surprise because we love everything mm -hmm. that Olaplex has, but it's like a leave-in conditioner that I don't think it does a ton for defrizzing. It says it eliminates frizz. As you can see, they have a lot of flyaways. I don't think it does that, but it definitely nourishes. And I feel like I use I use my straightener today and I feel like it did act as like a protectant too, like a heat protectant. Um, I don't think you can get it really close to your roots or it does make it a bit oily in my opinion. I have pretty fine hair. But yeah, I've really been liking this so far. I used it twice this week and I'm just really imp impressed. It also makes it easy for my hair to be brushed through. Like usually I have to use a mm -hmm. detangler. And just with this in the Olaplex oil alone, I'm able to brush through my hair. So that was really surprising because my hair gets so tangled. So, so far, really liking this. Okay, next up is a food favorite. We found, well, we had to order them actually because our Target didn't have them. Yeah. But the Oreo, the gingerbread Oreos. So are these like revamped? Yeah, they're like a new gingerbread um, Oreo. Yeah. We've always loved the gingerbread, but these are next level. They have like, well, it says gingerbread flavor cookie cream with crunchy sugar crystals and like those little crystals in the cream just add everything oh, they're so good they're like a great little texture it kind of has the same texture as like a candy cane bit like that okay yeah, yeah yeah um but it's yeah ginger and then i think they the old cookies were lighter these are deeper yeah and they're more of like a true gingerbread flavor i feel they're so good mm -hmm. they're amazing they could be my like favorite oreos Me too. well the pistachio oreos are my favorite yeah well, we think those got discontinued well there's no way i don't know what's happening but they've got to bring them back i don't know okay what's next okay next are these sweatshirts do you have yours yeah okay um, we got them at Target. Well, we ordered them again because um, Target's been having a lot of sales online. So we've been ordering a lot. What brand are these? A New Day. Mm -hmm. They're these A New Day sweatshirts. And they're really basic. They're just like a long sleeve sweatshirt. They have like this ribbing on the end of the sleeve yeah. and on the end of the sweatshirt, which is really cute. But I like the, de the stitch on the back too. Yeah, so there's a stitch on the back, which is a really cute detail. And then... Um, Again, the ribbing around the neck, and it's a crew neck, and it's almost like a little bit of a mock neck style. No, um, I think it's a crew neck. Yeah, it's actually the cream one is super similar to this Everlane sweatshirt I'd had I've had for like a year. It has the same detail on the back like this. The Everlane one is just a bit more cropped and thicker, um, but it's like one fourth or one fifth of the price. So yeah, and this really one impressed. is pretty cropped. Wouldn't mm -hmm. you say? Yeah, that one's just more cropped. Okay. So if I compare the two, then that one. Yeah, I like it because it's cropped because mm -hmm. I always like to wear sweatshirts, but I like to tuck them in like the, mm -hmm. the top or front tuck. Yeah. Um, and so this one, you don't really have to do that as much. And the price was insane. Like we were in Target and saw mm -hmm. these and they didn't have smalls left in the colors that we wanted. So you know how when you're in Target, you can scan an item and then it brings it up like on the app. So I did that and then I realized they were on sale for like $14 on the app. So we just placed an order mm -hmm. like while we were shopping at Target. So such a good deal. I mean, I hope they go on sale even more like again for Black Friday yeah. and I can get more colors. Yeah, I love this. I want more too because we just like live in these now that we're just home all the time. Yeah, so they're really great and they're soft. Yes. Okay, next I have a show favorite. I don't know if you guys have seen it. It's called Dash and Lily on Netflix. And I hadn't even heard of this. I feel like Netflix has been releasing a lot of movies and shows lately that like I didn't even see advertised mm -hmm. for. But it was centered, it's like a festive holiday show. So I decided to watch it. It's basically about um, the first episode. I don't know if this gives anything away. I don't think so. But um, the girl Lily sends Dash on like kind of a scavenger hunt in their favorite bookstore and they're total strangers but Dash is like following her clues in these books throughout the bookstore and then obviously he like wants to meet her in real life and it's just you know it's all about their relationship but they're so cute like you know teenage love stories always really get me um and it's a really cute show i love that it's around christmas time lily is like a christmas fanatic dash not so much um it's in new york city and i always find it so interesting when there's like kids in new york city mm -hmm. because 
that way of life is so different from how most people in America like, like they're super independent very independent mm -hmm. but like yeah the fact that they like go to school but then there's like so many activities for them to do that are like safe normal activities for kids but it's like because you're in a huge city there's just like you can literally do anything like Lily forms a caroling troupe with like her adult friends because that like that's something she could do in New York and I always just find it so interesting when there's like kids in New York in a show setting um so I love that aspect as well but I thought it was super cute there's only eight episodes really easy to get through highly recommend it Okay, last are these bottle brush trees we got from, do you want to hold one? There's sure. like green in that one, I'm not sure why. From Hobby Lobby. From Hobby Lobby, and they're really pretty, they're a cream color, and if you haven't had a bottle brush tree, they're like these like, um, like, what would you say, like wire, kind of like fibers. Yeah. Um, and they have this look to them, which, and most of them are usually like flocked, and they have glitter, so it's really hard to find ones that aren't shimmery glitter or like neutral ones are hard to find too yeah so we got this one of the medium sized ones last mm -hmm. year and i don't know why we didn't buy more but we only got one we actually have a lot of bottle brush trees and we did buy some of the colored ones but for our living room we like the neutral aspect mm -hmm. and so we got one of those last year and then i was like oh they have large ones we should go back and of course they always have a sale yeah so it's 50 percent off so i think this large one was only eight dollars and then those were like six yeah i want to say such a good deal compared to like the ones at Target, which we do have some from Target, but um, we had to mention them because it's so hard to find this color scheme. Yeah, if you like similar um, Christmas decor to us. Yes. Hobby Lobby. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you had a great week and we'll see you next week.